rather, a rather stupid question in a way. Which is better, Canaletto or Guardi? Well, the combination of the two would be the idea. See? Just look at the, how they depicted, depicted the emerald green of the lagoon of Venice. Canaletto painted it like he painted the palaces, in the same structure. Guardi, more lyric, he was floating on the water. Canaletto is the one that came before and he discovered unconsciously surrealism because he made this double image of Venice, the obvious and the hidden one. Guardi, he enhanced the poetic vision of Venice. He's a lyric, incredible Dante of Venice. So, I prefer an ideal spiritual marriage of the two. This is what I'm striving to. Being oblivious of, of the anguish for detail of Canaletto in looking forward the freedom of Wadi, but one needs the other. Venice needs the water and the air to be Venice.